If you could trade, would you? Surely. But all miracles require sacrifice for their life. Yours. I mean, what else can I say about that trailer? That was just insane looking. Like, the amount that DE are stepping up, it's actually crazy to me. Because watching that trailer and over and over, it gives me chills. Because Umbra just looks so badass. I'm near the point of fanboying because I want to have that frame now just because of that trailer. Like, originally, I wasn't really too hyped up for Umbra. Because I was like, oh yeah, it's probably just going to be a new frame. But, you know... Being able to run around while playing the game on stream, max settings, customizing my Umbra that looks as badass as possible just sounds so appealing to me right now because, you know, I try to make my frames look as badass as possible and you guys know that with my Excalibur. I can't imagine the amount of coolness I could achieve with Umbra, you know, it, it must be just insane. But uh, let's talk a little bit about the quest that we might have to do to get Umber, basically, because in the trailer they talk a lot about sacrifice, and there's like a heartbeat thing in the background, and, you know, who's gonna die, what are we gonna have to give up, these are all the questions that we have to ask, and it's like, you know, you have to give something away, so it must be the life of either a Tenno, or a Warframe, or another NPC, that we're gonna have to trade for Umbra, that's what a lot of people are speculating, Personally, I think it might just be the original Warframe that you have to the have to trade. Um, I don't think they'd go as far as to make you trade in your Prime Warframe. I think it'll be like an upgrade to your original frame. So Umbra might be slightly worse than Primes because you know the only reason that I say the Umbra might be slightly worse than Primes is because you know people spend money on Prime frames, and unless DE change it to where they give away Umbra frames in the uh, the Prime access packs and make it an Umbra access pack, then I would assume that you know the people who buy the Prime things they get like a little edge, you know that they're buying that and they're getting the best in the game, so to speak, right? Um, so that's why I think that Umbra might be, you know, just like a side grade to the original frame, but I'm hoping that, that it has some quirk to it. You know, I hope that there's a reason to go out of your way to get Umbra, to use Umbra, like they are only able to use sentient weapons, or they're only able to use a specific type of weapon, or they have this really cool ultimate ability, or whatever the case may be. Maybe the ability swap around, maybe uh, it's something to do with focus, or whatever. I hope that there's some redeeming factor to Umbra, but there's that like little speculation in the back of my head that maybe Umbra won't be as good in terms of, you know, the prime frames. Like they won't be as powerful. They won't have as much armor. They won't have as much energy just because of that whole, uh, you know, you can pay to get your prime items and the prime items are meant to be best in the game. Maybe that's not the case because there are a lot of shitty prime weapons out there, which, you know, uh, I can't actually think of one off the top of my head. The Sigurus Prime used to suck, but they buffed that. It only took them a couple of years, but, you know, there's a lot of shitty Prime weapons out there, and maybe I'm just overthinking things too much because of the Prime frames and stuff, and people paying for them, but, you know, hopefully Umbra, in some way, shape, or form, has some sort of different gameplay mechanic to it, and has, like, a reason to go and get it, other than just, oh yeah, it looks cool, because... It looks cool, but it would be even cooler if you could, like, I don't know, turn into a shadow or something, or something like that there happened, or maybe you got a buff when it was nighttime, or you're in the dark or something. I just want Umbra to be awesome. I'm sure everybody wants Umbra to be awesome. Leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below in regards to Umbra, because, like I said, I want it to be awesome. I'm interested to see how the quest actually turns out, because I'm super excited to see how they go with it. 
because it feels like just from that trailer it might be more of like an impactful action quest rather than like you know the slow sort of mood setting quest that the second dream was because you had the atmosphere being created in the trailer itself with the whole heart beating thing signifying loss is going to happen in some way she performed but then again you have the fucking umbra jumping from rock to rock to, to bring out the sword and then swish the sword and um you know that that signifies to me that there's going to be some sort of action there's going to be some sort of fighting um which is hopefully very fast paced maybe we have to fight an umbra frame or something of the sort um maybe there's a lot of different paths we can go down because you know that the karma system is a thing in warframe so we have you know the good guys we have the bad guys and we have the guys that stay neutral so i'm interested to see how that affects it and maybe that might affect how your umber frame acts in some way shape or form maybe if you're a bad guy the umber might be more lenient lenient towards you i guess you could say or maybe if you're a good guy it might be that way as well you know like maybe you know the umbra is more attracted to a certain type of tenu that could be also a thing this is just all speculation guys so don't take uh, what i am saying as word but uh, like i said it's just going to be interesting to see how it all plays out and i want to hear what you guys have to say about umbra down below because i'm sure there's a lot of speculation about it like i said I was not too excited for Umbra until I saw this trailer and I seen that he was going to be included in the quests. I knew he was going to be included in a quest. I just didn't know he'd be here this soon. And like I said, interested to see how it plays out. So leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button below and you'll see more Warframe content from me. Hit subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.